<sighs> okay. Here we go. Let's see if I can do this. Backpack, Mo, subscribe to the show. Here we go. Now that I have your attention, thank you guys. Welcome back, man. This is Backpack Mo, back with another video as well. Uh, thank you guys already for those who have given the likes and subscribes already to the channel. If you haven't already done that, please go ahead and share and do that. I really appreciate you. Uh, today I got a nice fun-filled show for you. Gonna be a guest. We're gonna bring some excitement more to the channel as well. So, but uh, before I do that, I gotta make myself a drink, man. You know, it, it is pretty, uh, you know, humid outside. Um, so, yeah, let, let me get uh, something. My, my, my throat's a little parched, so I'm gonna go and make you guys the backpack mo margarita, and I'm gonna teach you how to do it. It's very simple. And if you guys, um, if I go too fast for you, don't worry. All the uh, ingredients will be for the drink below in the description box. Okay, so uh, first thing that I want to add to it, you know, margarita, you, you need tequila, you know. Um, you can get any tequila that you want to get. You know, I, I get, uh, I like this one, Clase Azul. Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen, I did a video for this on the, on the Mezcal. You can go check that out later too as well. And then uh, the other ingredient, you're going to need an orange liqueur, but if, I guess if we're going with good tequila, we might as well go with good orange liqueur. So I have the Cointreau bottle right here. And of course, um limes got some lime juice so i like to use fresh limes i don't know if you guys can see over here but yeah fresh lime juice is always better than the concentrate anything that you're going to uh, buy in the store you get a really good taste and you can taste the difference in the margarita so i definitely uh suggest always use fresh lime juice and you can only use it as a garnish too so um but yeah we're pretty simple we have all the ingredients here uh to make it um wait a minute hold on no, we don't. Actually, we have a secret ingredient. You know, the backpack mo uh, ingre uh, margarita wouldn't just be, you know, without itself. The secret ingredient we have right here, the fire bee honey, it's a spicy honey. So uh, made with chilies and it's also an organic raw honey too. So you get all the good flavors, all the good stuff from it too. And if you guys want to get this honey, you can check out in the description box. There's a link over there that links me there to you guys. It would help me out appreciate it if you go ahead and uh, go ahead and buy it. So. Now that we have all the ingredients, um, let's go ahead and make the margarita. You guys are probably like, you know what? Go ahead and stop talking. Let's go ahead and get this. All right, so. All right, let's shake it for you. You want to give it a good, good 20, 20 to 30 seconds. All right, now let's see how this tastes. You guys be the judge once you make these at home and go in and uh... All right. Seems about a good amount. And let's try it, see what it tastes like. Ooh, it's good. Um, not overly spicy, but the honey, um, the honey replaces, you know, a little bit of the sweetness, but the good balance of the margarita now. It's not gonna kill you. You don't have to add jalapenos, you don't have to add anything. But I gotta take one more sip just to make sure. Woo, backpack mode margarita. How many stores know you? Check it out, man, cheers to you. Time to go make that uh, next transition. We are going to go and work with the producer today. We're going to the studio. So um, if you guys want to go roll along with me, let's do it. All right, guys, it looks like we're ready. So um, now we're going to go to the studio. Just like I told you, I'm going to take you with me alongside. You know, we're, we're, leave, we're leaving the, the Backpack Mo Studios and we're actually going to a real studio right now to go visit Steve and you know lay down some tracks see what it's like you know uh, I've never done anything like that before this is my first time 
But yeah, this is the experience for, for you guys too. So um, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring you along with me. So let walk with me. Here we go. Let's do it. I think we're all suited up. Backpacks on. Everything's good to go. Yes, it is. Let's get over here. Getting the whip and uh, you know, time to roll out. All right, guys. Got my producer with me. We're about to ride down over there. We're in. We're ready to go, man. Safety first, man. Make sure put the seatbelts on. And then uh, we're off to the studio. So like I said, um, you guys, we did find a jingle already with, uh, you know, after that we're, we're trying to find a jingle. Uh, we did look for a logo. If you guys still want to send some ideas in for the logo, for the uh, for the channel, I'm definitely looking towards that. So um, please do if if you can. You know, if you want to, you're an artist or you're you know graphic designer and you want to send some stuff out, please let me know. But you know, we got some projects right now. We're going to work on it and then you know make this thing happen. Right now, we're, we got to get that. We got to get the theme song. You know, uh, because I want to have something else besides you know from you know what I, what I'm giving uh, giving you know with instead of copyright stuff. You know, that's the thing with YouTube. You really can't. Put, uh, unless it's your own music, you know, you're very selective of what it, of what you can have. So um, I definitely, you know, want to rather have my own stuff, you know, put it on. And that's where we're about to go make, or, you know, we're about to go make magic happen, you know, and you guys are about to, to vibe with me there. So if you part, we'll follow up the uh, holler at Steve, man, and um, catch up and do a little Q&A. And then we'll transition into, you know, making uh, making some music. So. Uh, stay tuned, you know, like I said, we're, we're, we're right there, pulling up right now, actually. All right, we are here, we are here, we are here. I'm a little nervous, but uh, we're going to make it happen. I don't know. This is all new to me, you know, and hopefully it's, you know, for those of you guys who've never seen anything like this before it'll be pretty cool for you too as well so we're about to experience all of this together all right let's knock on this leg down let's knock on the door what's good bro let's go let's go let's go let's go okay bad bad man and actual gun all right, guys, backpack mode, right back at it, man. We're in the studio now. Hope, thank you guys for riding with me. That was a short trip, like I said. And now, uh, you know, introduce the man, Steve. Thank you, bro. This is the studio, the lab, the dungeon, where the where all the hits get made. Uh, yes, you know sir, what I'm saying? Yes, uh, sir. Tell me a little about it, man. I've never been in a studio before. I've never been in any type of thing. So this is all new to me. I don't know what keys yeah, do yeah, what. I don't know what sure. is, uh, you know? Um, yeah, man, so this is Enemy Music Recordings, you know, this is a uh, home studio based out of Northern Virginia, located in Fairfax, uh, we're with a lot of local rappers, um, a lot of singers, you know, a few podcasters, you know, actually the whole way I got connected right now is with your cameraman right now, actually, he came in to record some shit, so, you know, we're just out here, you know, making people's dreams happen and trying to make the, uh, the best mixes we can happen, actually, let me rephrase that, we're not making people's dreams happen, we're just trying to make their vision come to true. No, you are making you know dreams happen, because uh, um, I would say, like, I mean, for me, I've never been to a place like this, but I know now that I got the, the equipment's there and all I got to do is... You know, lay the tracks down. You know, me as yeah. the artist to be able to put it. You have everything we need. It just, you know, I gotta bring my my A game, or you know, me that's as the band or the group has to bring that. So uh, yeah. that's great. Um, tell me, uh, so when you started this, man, and when did you learn that you know you you knew you had the skill, or you know, you, you could do all these things? Uh, I remember when I was nineteen, I was just like, yo, like I really fuck with editing and just like mixing the voices and like recording and shit, and just adding in all the effects, you know, just to like kind of bring the track to life. I got you. Um, so I would say about like 19 years old, I was like, yo, I really want to fucking like just like do this music shit with like engineering and mixing and stuff. So you like, bought all this stuff yourself or did you start, what was your little starter kit? What was your, what was the first thing that you had when you, you were coming up in the game, you know, before you had this whole, you know, studio? Yeah, you know? Um, actually, so how did it go? Uh, my parents always had like a laptop. Okay. And. I downloaded like acoustic mix card. Gotcha. I think that's what it's called. And I would always fuck around with like a little headset and shit, you know, like a little yeah, yeah, yeah. headphones with the with the headphone uh, okay. the mic attached. Yeah. 
Um, and I just, once again, you know, just fell in love with the whole process of recording and editing. Okay. And uh, then when I was like 18, I had like $300 in my bank account, like $300 left. And I went out for my birthday and I bought like... Actually, that M box right there, you see it? Look okay. The, zoom the camera on that real quick if you can. Yeah. Uh, that little blue you. inbox right there I bought when I was 18. That kind of okay. was like the birth of the Soul Studio. Gotcha. So That's the first interface I had. You keep it there. It's always reminding you, know, yeah. where, you where you started from. Too. I bought that with the last $300 of my bank account. And now okay. I have like this whole like real yeah. studio business. So always, always invest in yourself, you know? Even if it's like the last money in your bank account, like invest in yourself no matter what. Yeah, because you're making your dreams come true and you're, you're, and you're doing what you, you like. You know, this is not, yeah. I'm not just a job for you, but this is something that you love, you know? And yeah, it really not, is. Not that many people can sit back and say, you know, like I'm, I'm doing my dream job. I'm doing something that I, that I love instead of just, you know, going and, you know, doing what yeah. your normal uh, normal day life. But this is this is great. You know, your your dreams have become a reality, you know, in a sense for sure, you to know, work yeah. with other people too as well. Always, man. Always. Uh, so you said you, you started, you know, Damn. So, you've been you've been at it for a while. Uh, yeah. And any particular artists or anyone that you that you think are up and coming, or stuff that you kind of produced, uh, full albums, or is it just beats, or is it uh, um, how did you get the whole composure? Of, uh, who, who who do you have out there? I would say. Uh, right now, top of my head, this one artist I, I I work with. His name's Conan. He's like nineteen. He just released a song that I recorded and mixed for him called Yes Please. It got like six K plays on SoundCloud. Okay. And he did that with like no marketing and like pretty much just dropping out of nowhere. Right. And I thought I thought that was pretty good. Um but yeah, his name's like Conan K O N A and he dropped a song called Yes Please and that's when he's doing numbers on SoundCloud. Um who else? Uh, there's just so many artists in the area that I can just shout out who I'm working with. Right, yeah, that day, we, yeah, we can do that too. Uh, really, yeah. man, you know, like, uh, a couple of day ones, um, you know, my homie Drew Blaze, he's been with me since, like, I was, you know, sold off in the apartment of rest then. Uh, my homie Jeff Mitchell, you know, uh, one of my day ones. Uh, I got just so many, man. Um, I can't even think of anyone right now. But uh, those are just two main dudes that, like, who I... Uh, found them like just working you know, okay. this whole like life yeah. and everything that's, that's what it's all about man. Yeah, like yeah, i said yeah. this you know we're all on this channel man you know we like i said we want to work with local people you yeah. know we're we're, we're, yeah, we're we're not uh where we want to be yet but you know yeah. we're, you know it's help each, help each other grow out you know um yeah and promote each other you know especially you know to young brothers out there you know we always try to look out for each other and uh, make sure everything you know spread some positivity right you know, in right thing, you know? yeah absolutely and, uh, when we all become big you know people can come back and look at back Right. And say, hey, you know, there, there was the little man looking out for the little man. You know? <laughs> yeah. So, you know, um, that's what we're about, man. So great, man. I, I love, um, I love, I love this, the setup. I, lo I love the studio, man. Um, I would definitely like to, you know, maybe hear something. You know, we done enough yeah. talking. Let's, yeah. let, let's 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 hear a little thing right, or two. See what you got. Yeah. So you said you're looking for like a little intro or something. Yeah, like man. Song. I definitely like, need something for the channel. You know, different vibes. Start off with something slow for Okay. Some time. stuff that yeah. Just throw some stuff that you like. Great. <laughs> I'm gonna be critical now, okay? Alright, man. Alright, we're gonna yeah. see. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, like. which one you want to fuck with? Uh, 
I like I like that last track actually. All right, bet. Yeah, yeah, I like the actual last one. That last one was good. Trust me, I've been, I've been thinking about it the whole day. I'm like, all right, how am I gonna put this? How am I gonna put this? I don't want it to sound like stupid. Cause the beat's nice. Yeah, the beat is good. Okay, yeah. I have no idea what to fucking say. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, I, I'm not, a, I'm not, a, I'm not a fucking rapper, bro. Yeah, no. Yeah. That's cool. We just a lot. We just a lot. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just, I'm, I'm just a good guy, regular guy, man. And that's it. Dude, it's gonna be yeah. just funny, whatever. Right. Like, it's but that that that's that's good, but it's too yeah. slow for the beat. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because it means like you gotta be like, it's, it's gotta go like that. Like the rap is good, but it it doesn't match the doesn't match the beat. Yeah, yeah. Well, the, that that should be that the ending then. You know, you should start with something else, something quick, and then the, the ending should be that. You know, I, 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 I'm just trying I have to... no idea. Can can you put the beat one more time? Yeah, yeah. We have no idea what the fuck to fucking rap on this shit. That's the thing that I like. You can do the whole pop smoke flow, the uh, with the robbery jump. You can be like back mo. You go, what is it? Backpack. Yeah, backpack mo. Uh -huh. Yeah, backpack. Mo, at you. Oh, that's how the pop smoke. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> true, true, true. Let's listen. <laughs> Let's listen. <laughs> That's just gonna yeah. sound tight, actually. Yeah. You gotta do the deep boys, the deep, sexy pop smoke voice. All the girls are crazy for. Pepe, Mo. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wait, why are we not recording this? Yeah, yeah right, right, right. Right. Shit. No, we're going to. We're gonna film up with Damn, that. Damn, we just missed all the golden. Movies. That's no, exactly. This, this is Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, too, no. yeah. So you got to come back and tell me, like, because I'm gonna ask you. See, hey, yeah. hey, dude, I, I don't, I don't know what, what do I do? do I, how do I step up to the plate? Like, am I good? Do I need to step back from the mic? Can you hear me? All right, bro. Now that we got that beat, man. Shoot, man. That mic, that microphone is uh, tempting me, man. Can, can get, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna, I, I say, let's just do something right now, man. All right, if we can. All right, now, now guide, guide me, you know, because I never, like I said, I never done nothing like this before, so. All right, I know you said you was filming this one, so. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me, let me get in the zone, man. Yeah, yeah, I got the look, but I gotta, I gotta get in the zone first. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I won't. You know, I gotta make sure. There you go. And hopefully, uh, am I good? Yeah. Hold up. Oh man, okay. All right, all right. You good? The microphone check. You can hear me? Yes, sir. I like that beat. I'm going to turn the monitors down, turn the headphones up. Okay. Here we go. <sighs> Woo! Okay. Here we go. Let's see if I can do this. Backpack. Mo. Swap shop. To the show, here we go, yeah. Yeah, that's good right now, I like that. Okay, okay. Okay, here we go. Let's see what I can do this. Backpack, Mo, Swap Shop, to the show. <laughs> I like it a lot, bro. So, okay. So, Steve, man, thank you, man. That was fun, man. That was a good experience just to, you know, get out and uh, I never done something like that. Like I said, it was the first time. You know, that was one track that I was able to lay down. Um, it was awesome, man. I, I really, really, really felt it, man. I felt like I was a, you know, <sighs> we're gonna win that Grammy, you know. Hey man. Um, okay. Thank you uh, for coming on the show, go. man. And if you guys want to work with Steve, I'll leave all of his social media links right in the description box, uh, right so below too, as well. Definitely check him out if you guys actually are serious about this. And then uh, putting some music down. Let me let him know. And I uh, appreciate you guys one more time checking out Backpack Mo. Love you. Appreciate you. Backpack move on the soul. Back, 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 in the back. Take a
take a step back with Backpack. Subscribe to the show, that's what you gotta do, baby.